Well, things continue to look bleak for Justin Trudeau. Well, Canadians have had enough. Most of the country has a negative impression of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. Canadians, I think, are, are, are growing tired of the current government. When it comes to Justin Trudeau as a leader, that a lot of people think it is time for him to step aside. He's, he's really clinging on. Um, dismissing the polls, dismissing anybody uh, that is saying anything against his government that he should go. While a majority of Canadians think it is time for Trudeau to step aside. Canada's support for Prime Minister Justin Trudeau as leader of the Liberal Party seems to be fading. What does this mean for Justin Trudeau? 56% of respondents said they would like someone other than Justin Trudeau to lead the party. Yeah, it's about two-thirds of voters who say that he should step aside. He actually tried to undermine the entire polling industry and the credibility of polls. And you know who does that? People who are losing it right now, Justin Trudeau. Yeah. Losing badly. Only 17% said Trudeau should stay on as leader. Um, it's, th these numbers are grim. The worst results he's ever had. This shows a, uh, or follows rather, a continued trend and a continued slow decline in Justin Trudeau's approval rating. Trudeau's net approval rating is negative 32, the lowest in his tenure. The numbers just seem to be getting worse for the Prime Minister. Canadians are ready for change. Canadians are three times more likely to prefer someone other than Justin Trudeau to lead the Liberal Party. The Prime Minister has made it clear as well, uh, asked repeatedly, that he um, has, does not plan to step down. Justin Trudeau is a mascot of everything that is wrong in the world today. Well, I think it's clear they want change. <laughs> if you're in Canada and you're watching this, you got, you got to think about what to do. You got to think about what to do. I could not care less if the elected leader of Canada seeks to drive his nation into the dumps. He, uh, the, the Australian, Australian uh, media took a run at him recently with, with one show calling him a neo-Marxist Ken, Ken doll. The neo-Marxist Ken doll himself, Justin Trudeau. From cheap gimmicks to tokenism to attempts to creating culture of politically correct absurdities. If this is the direction that Canada is going in, what will Canada look like? Uh, in five years. So why is Trudeau unpopular? So what has Justin Trudeau done in Canada over the last couple of years? Well, lockdowns, vaccinations, forcing people out of work, all of that stuff. Justin Trudeau has declared an emergency act, the, the strongest and most repressive tool in his government to try and silence and starve these people, to stop them getting them hands on their own money, to stop them getting uh, petrol, to stop them getting food. This is the same guy who was jailing truckers who were protesting him. Never forget, this is the monster who falsely branded Canadian truckers as extremists and white supremacists and then froze their bank accounts. Who was jailing literally priests and closing churches and all of that. I don't believe for a second that he has any such thing as principles. He humiliated himself. And they're ready for, for new leadership uh, of the country. I don't think anybody who lies with every single word and gesture ever has principles. He's just absolutely awful. So. I need to trust that the leader of my nation is going to make good decisions. It's insane what Trudeau is doing. From what I've been able to observe, it's all stage acting. He's not, he's not defending Canada. He's not defending the people of Canada. I don't believe that he ever says a word that's true. I'm not looking for a friend. Um, I'm looking for somebody I think can make good decisions. It is an absolute disgrace. This is what Justin Trudeau is. He is a deeply dishonest, basically soulless, soulless nothing. I don't think I've ever heard him say a true word. Trudeau, you know, we all thought, wow, cool guy, right? What a disappointment. I mean, the fact that the Canadians have voted in Trudeau makes me question their intelligence. Adios.